Keith Mann was a man I knew very well. Keith was a very dynamic fellow, uh, just loved music. And Keith uh, became a school teacher. He was taught at uh, Innisfail and built up a very successful music program there, uh, what they called the Innisfail Imps. His big success was he became the director of the Red Deer Royals Marching Wheel Band, which was you know, Red Deer's leading community band. And he was very successful. He really knew how to inspire the kids and, uh, and, and work well with parents and uh, really pushed uh, taking both their cities to different band competitions and also inviting other groups to come to Red Deer. And it was extremely popular in the community and uh, really built up a strong program. But because he was so highly thought of in the community, people wanted to have something to remember him, and uh, hence the proposal to do a ghost statue of him. Uh, another thing that's unique about his ghost statue is the city did have a policy that said that there would not be any statues or things like that in City Hall Park, but in Keith's case, they made an exception, so it stands on the west side of City Hall Park. He was an extremely nice man very passionate and committed to what he did, loved what he did, and a man that we certainly miss and unfortunately is still remembered with the statue in the park.